So the first method is to have a bookmark folder. And you can see I have a bookmark folder in my books, bookmarks bar called gaming. So if I click on that, you can see I have two websites in my uh, bookmarks folder. The first one is GameSpot and the second one is Steam. So to open these simultaneously, all I have to do is to right click on that folder and say open all. So I left click on that option. You can see I now have two additional websites loading simultaneously. So the first one is GameSpot, which will load in a second. And then the second one is Steam. So this is one way to open multiple URLs when you have Chrome already open. So there is another method you can use um, if Chrome isn't open. So if you want to open multiple URLs without opening Chrome first and then clicking on a uh, subfolder in your bookmarks bar. And that is to use a bat file. So if I just close Chrome down all together and on the desktop if I create a new text file uh, text document and if I double click on that so what I'm going to do now is to create a bat file which will open multiple URLs in Chrome simultaneously so first we begin with the at echo off command. What this does is it stops your code or your script displaying on the screen. And then the first line we're going to enter is start and then the name of the browser that we're using. I'm using Chrome. And then we open quotation marks. And then we type in the name of the website, the URL of the website. So let's, 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 let's see. Amazon first. And then once we've entered the address or the URL of the website, I'm going to close the quotation marks. And we can add in another website. So again, we give it star. And then the name of the browser you're using. So I'm going to use Chrome. And open quotation marks for the second website. And I'm just typing in the URL of the second website that we're going to open. And then we finish them to a new URL and just close with the quotation mark. So now what we need to do is to save this as a dot bat file, a Windows batch file. So if I click file and save as it's on the desktop and quite important that you select as type all files and then if we just name it a file name and end the file name with a dot bat extension and if I click save it should appear on the desktop okay so now what we have is So now what we have is our sites dot bat file, our Windows batch file. So now if I double click on this, it should open Chrome and the two websites that we entered into our batch file should open simultaneously. And this is all with just with one double click. That should be nice and simple. Double click the file. Wait for Chrome to load. And you can see the two websites loading are the two that we entered into our batch file. So our first is Amazon, you can see that's loading. And the second one should be eBay. 
拜拜。